Hello and welcome back and today I want to talk about a brand new mesh router but not just any mesh router I want to talk about QNAP making the move into mesh routers that's right I want to talk about the QMIRO or QMIRO 201W now this is some information that was leaked to me very recently about a brand new solution from the guys at QNAP now they are a brand that aren't just known in the world of NAS they're also known in the world of different peripheral devices they you know dip to toe into all kinds of network equipment. More precisely, recently, we've seen a lot of moves from them in the world of switches and a Wi-Fi 6 solution too. And it looks like they are starting, they are at least very far into the development of a mesh router system known as the QMIRO or QMIRO, Q-M-I-R-O, forgive the pronunciation, 201W. This is a mesh router system now at the moment we only seemingly know about this satellite device this is a mesh satellite device whether they're going to release a router system in parallel with it we don't know i'm going to go through everything i know about this system in the documents that have been leaked to me and all the things i don't know i am going to let you guys know the things that are kind of guesswork given the a kind of release schedule of this first and foremost this satellite device is a tri-band mesh system for those that aren't aware a tri-band mesh system is one that has three bandwidths generally the frequencies that are covered uh, if you look at a number of other mesh systems they have generally you find ones that have got 2200 in the title and again that means that this has got a single 2.4 gigahertz channel which is normally 400 megabits per second and two 5 gigahertz channels are normally at five, um, 866 uh, megabits per second each. And that normally is the one that adds up to a total coverage of approximately 2,200 uh, 2, megabits per second. So, this tri-band mesh system, this little pod that we know about, this little satellite device here, it is kind of grey in design, covered in ventilation. I'm sure the graphics are somewhere on screen while I'm talking about it. This has a single WAN port for your wireless access uh, network port or your wide area network even. And there is a LAN port as well. Both RJ45 obviously and seemingly from what I can see one GBE. Although it would be really interesting if they go down that two and a half, uh, two and a half gigabit route, that 2.5 GBE. There's also a USB 3 port on board as well, which means there's going to be an element of storage, um, external um, networking capabilities as well. I can imagine this isn't the first time we've seen QNAP talk about routers. A couple of years ago at CES, they tried to show a lot of people the TGX 150, one of the few devices that they've ever actually gone quiet on. And this um, wireless satellite device does suggest that there is a wireless router somewhere out there as well. Now, there are capabilities that I do know about just looking at the hardware. There's a WPS button built into the top. There's LEDs. There's all that ventilation I've already talked about. External PSU. It's a 24-watt external PSU as well. Even the dimensions of the device. It re it looks like it's about 23 centimeters high. Luckily, the photos we've got, I've got dimensions on them. So 23 centimeters high, call it about that big. And on top of that width, it's about 12 centimeters wide and about nine centimeters deep. So it is kind of a standalone one. And I'd say it's not dissimilar to that of that Linksys Velop that we have here in the background of a lot of our videos. Now, I would say that that is a tri-band device as well. They sell it in packs of three, those ones. And they knock around for about 80 to 99 pounds per satellite model. Um, I will say that there is no confirmation whatsoever whether this is Wi-Fi 6. And I really hope it's Wi-Fi 6 because they are not the first brand to take um, their first steps into the world of mesh routers. If we have a look, Synology were the first brand. They got into the mesh router system here. This is the MR2200AC. That is a tri-band router. So again, I can totally imagine um, QNAP making moves into Wi-Fi 6 with this kind of stuff. There isn't a vast number of Wi-Fi 6 mesh routers out there. Netgear have got the Orbi series, Asus. I've got the RTIX um, 92U. There aren't a lot of Wi-Fi 6 routers out there, so hopefully this will have Wi-Fi 6, particularly given big, big leaps from them into both 2.5 GBE and Wi-Fi 6. Now, why is this a big deal as far as I'm concerned? Well, first and foremost, QNAP has an incredible history of network equipment. A lot of their resources 
both in software and hardware, both in terms of switch management, they've got their NAS combo systems in place. And I do think a lot of the file management and network virtual switch kind of technology will be passed over into a device like this. Unfortunately, this is kind of the limit of all the information I've got from these documents. A lot of them in Taiwanese, as you would expect. And there's a lot of photos that we can garner a lot from. I hope the design stays the way. It's because I really quite like the design. I think it's a nice contained unit there. And whether it'll be WPS3, we don't know. Um, I assume it will be. In the same way of Wi-Fi 6, there's no confirmation, but I think it will be Wi-Fi 6. This is quite a short video compared to my other vids because largely because this is pretty much everything we know. There's no way this is looking at retail anytime soon. But I am very interested in this because Wi-Fi 6 is something we talk about on the channel all the time. And there is a link in the description to NAS Compares where we will go into more detail as we learn more and we'll talk more and more about this device. But I hope you guys are as excited as I am about this because frankly, there is not enough um, kind of merging of these NAS brands and wireless routers and wi-fi hardware in the rest of our network environment we've got switches we've got the odd you know nick network interface card upgrade there's not enough integration between all this and i would rather have one brand with all the peripherals throughout but this has been the qnap mesh router system the Cumiro or Cumiro 201 w satellite system i hope to talk about a router soon fingers crossed otherwise Click like if you've enjoyed this, click subscribe to learn more, and I'll see you next time.